What's up everybody, Kwan here, back at another video. So today, we're gonna be talking about my five tips slash secrets to help you build muscle, all right? Um, I've been lifting now for about 16 years, but I've been consistent for about 12. I started when I was 14, got super serious when I was 18, and I'm about to turn 30 in a couple of weeks. But with that being said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, turn on post notifications, because guys, we're at 39,600 subs. I wanna to get to that 40K by my birthday in about two weeks for November 1st. So, like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, share with a friend, let everybody know what we're doing over here and we're having fun. And I can keep sharing tips and videos for you guys. We can keep making our gains together, all right? So let's keep it going and do this for free so we can get out here and have a good time. All right, so, my five tips on building muscle. Number one, folks, carbs are your best friend. Do not let these gimmicks and these people tell you that you don't need carbs to build muscle. You shouldn't be eating carbohydrates. You need your glycogen. You need that energy in your muscle to help you build size. As you break those muscles down, the energy source that's being burned is glycogen, right? And you get that from your carbs. So, carbs are glycogen rather. So, number one, get those carbs in. Um, you can use a macro tracker, get a macro cal uh, calculator, you know, type in that you're trying to build muscle, put it in there and it'll tell you how many carbs you need. You know, don't eat like the, the carbs like, um, don't eat a bunch of, you know, crap, but you can get your grains in, you can get, you know, your quinoa in and stuff like that. It's going to be super high carb carbohydrates and stuff that's easy for your body to break down and di digest. And if you're thinking about <clears throat> getting a quick little carb insulin spike, you can eat something like, I'm a big fan of like gummy bears and stuff like that, like right before you work out. It's like high in sugar, high in like that, that real, I call it bad sugar, but get that in right before you work out, get that nice spike, make sure everything's going good. And another way that you guys notice this is um, backstage and bodybuilding shows, you often see guys eating like Reese's and, and um, you know, gummy bears and stuff like that to get that nice insulin response, so they get that nice full thick look. That's just what their body needs to get that, the best look out of their muscle. And you should be, you know, getting your carbs in too, so you can look your best and grow and get the best, most out of your workouts in the gym, all right? so. Number one was those carbs. Number two, folks, folks, you got to know how to train. And if you're trying to build muscle, the best way to train is to be trained in hypertrophy range, which is eight to 12 reps. So you want to go eight to 12 reps on everything and don't overtrain either. You shouldn't be doing, you know, 15, 20 exercises per workout where you're doing, you know, four or five sets. That's, that's a hundred, you know, that's over, that's like a lot of, that's a lot of sets and reps, man. That's like a hundred sets. You shouldn't be doing that. I always recommend three to four sets of everything that you do. And I know more than six movements. That way you're still doing like 18 to 24 sets. But when you do those 18 to 24 sets in that hypertrophy range, it should be tough. The weight should be heavy enough where eight, nine, 10 reps is tough, really hard, but you still keep your good form. And by that third set, you shouldn't have anything left in the tank. So you're not going to be in here just you know, being, going slow and doing nonsense. You need to be in here training hard and, and, and working. Don't just lollygag in a gym. It should be intense, you should be dripping, you should be working, all right? Step number three, probably the most important thing on this list, guys, is you gotta get your sleep. Sleep is everything. Bodies are built when resting, not when you're in the gym. You tear it down in the gym and you recover when you're eating properly, which brings in those carbs, and when you're sleeping, folks. So get that rest, that way your body can grow, all right? My fourth tip, guys, I know, I know this stuff can be annoying, it can be difficult, it can be hard, but you got to eat at a caloric surplus. I know that you know a lot of us were trying to lose weight and build muscle, so you're eating too low. No, guys, you gotta make sure you're eating enough food for your body to grow and not be in that starvation mode. So let's say your calories that to lose weight is, are 2,000. I'd recommend eating 2,500 so that you can slowly build muscle as well, keep your cardio high and work, and you're gonna see your body shift. You don't have to bulk and cut, but you can eat slightly above your maintenance calories. That way you can still put on and build that nice, lean muscle tissue, okay? And I will say, this is my final tip. I know you guys might laugh, but this is what has helped me and what I think is like really, 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 really important. Guys, <clears throat> consistency. We watch these TikToks, Instagrams, YouTubes, all this stuff of people being like, oh, I gained... 30 pounds of muscle in six months and like so you train for six months and you only gain two whip two pounds three pounds and you're over here discouraging you don't want to work out anymore you don't want to train no guys that's not what you need to do you need to be in the gym you need to be working you need to be pushing yourself 
and you know it takes time. I'll put, Mo, you guys saw the thumbnail. In the thumbnail, you saw a picture of me when I was in high school to a picture of me now. That's a 12, 11, almost 12 year difference, guys. It's not easy, it doesn't happen overnight, but you can do this. You can grow, you can change, but you gotta know you're gonna be in it for the long haul. There's nothing in the world that's gonna make it instant. I promise you, nothing, not instant. You're gonna have to put the work in, you're gonna have to push yourself, and that way you can build the physique that you've always wanted. So I hope you enjoyed those five tips. Um, if you guys have any other fitness questions, go ahead and type them down below. I'll make videos on it. I'm gonna be doing a lot more of these style of videos just because I wanna make sure I give you guys the best information I can. I'll also still be doing my workouts. <clears throat> I'm also gonna be doing my you know, eating videos and grocery shopping videos and all that stuff. But I just wanna make sure you guys get the best information that I can provide for you based off my experience. I'm not saying my information is the best in the world or the only thing that's right, but this is just how I feel and what I've done in my 16 years of lifting and my 10 years of being a personal trainer slash fitness professional. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications if you guys need any supplements, anything like that, online training, click the links down below, sign up, let's get you guys going. I appreciate you, I love you guys. Thank you so much for everything you've done for me. And uh, yeah, man, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks, folks.